Hey everybody, uh, today's the day we are going to potluck and so I am going to get the turkey lattice pie done and I'm going to show you how to do it. Super simple, easy way to do it. Um, leftover turkey, you just need four cups of turkey. So let's get into it. I'll show you how to assemble everything. We've got our four cups of um, turkey in here. And then what I did beforehand is I came in and I took two rolls, <coughs> excuse me, of crescent rolls, the refrigerated ones, and then laid those out in a 15, oh, 15 by 10 by one pan and then brought, pressed the crust down and then um, brought it up a quarter inch up on the edge, right? So kind of making a deep dish crust, I guess. Um, and then you're going to take, let's see what I do with that sucker. And then you're going in a bowl uh, while that's baking, you're going to bake that, pre-bake it for five to seven minutes on that crust. And then you're going to go ahead and take your four cups of cubed turkey. You're going to put that in a bowl and then you're going to add one and a half cups of shredded cheese. And this can be cheddar, Swiss, just whatever, whatever you like. I'm using a combination, okay? Then we're going to add in um, three cups of chopped broccoli. Get that on in there. And then one large onion. We have the oven set at 375. <clears throat> um, then we're going to take one can of cream of chicken soup. Let's see if I can get that on out of there. There we go. Let's see. I can use this one here. Let's get all that out. Scrape it on out of there. Okay. Now we've got that added in there. And then we're going to take a one and a third cup of milk. And we're going to add that on in there. Okay. And then two tablespoons, excuse me, of Dijon mustard. Uh, half a teaspoon of salt. Dash of pepper. Okay, and then we're going to mix this all up. Super simple way to use up leftovers. It's also a great meal stretcher. Really, you could use whatever crust you wanted. <clears throat> okay, I think we have that pretty even now. All right, now, all right, now we're going to set this aside. Now we're bringing in our pie. You're going to add all the fillings just right down in here and layer it. Pretty good to me. Now I'm going to set this. That's cooled down. I'm going to set this aside because I need space. We're going to make the lattice. So you take your third roll 
of crescent dough. You're gonna, oh, darn it. I think I let that sit too long. There we go. Now, we want to make two triangles out of this. So we're going to separate it this way. And then we've got this one this way. Okay? I'm going to come in and we're going to press those little perforations there. And we're going to come in and we're going to make one inch strips. Dish back over. Kind of see how they'll fit in there. Now. It's kind of playing with your food a little bit. Just a little. Okay. Let's see how I did that. Now I have to go back and I have to look and see. I've got to remember how to do this. This weaving. It's tricky. I want everything to be opposite. Let's see if we can see that. <clears throat> I'm just going to go in and I'm going to tuck my corners there. 
so they don't fold up on me when it starts baking. All right, then I'm going to pop that in the oven 375, <clears throat> and we'll get it golden brown. Um, about 20 minutes, 25 minutes. Um, you want the lattice to be golden brown, and then you want the bubblies in here, um, all of your liquid pie coming together. So let's get it in the oven, and I'll bring it back to you and show you when it's finished. Oh, baby, there she is. So got her all done, and that is lattice turkey pie. The next time that you guys want to get creative with your food and just play around, this is a great recipe, fast, easy, simple, and a great way to stretch a dollar, too. So I think the broccoli was $3, uh, turkey was left over, so um, maybe if you can catch it on sale, I'm seeing them now for $0.98 cents a pound, um, you just get an extra turkey, I guess, and then um, you're talking a can of cream of chicken soup, an onion, um, some milk, seasonings, uh, two tablespoons of Dijon mustard, I don't know, uh, let's see, the crescent rolls, those were probably the most expensive out of everything, and I want to say I think maybe those were, I think it was two for 450 or 475 something like that, but this feeds 12 people, so I'm going to say I did everything here for I don't know, dollar, dollar twenty-five per person. You feed twelve off of it, so not too bad. And um, just a great way, great stretch, and um, have fun, guys. Have fun with your food. Don't be bored, and um, you play around and have a good time with it. So, all right. I don't know. I might be crazy. I just like playing with food. So, all right. You guys go out, live a life done free. Thanks, Milo.